to my channel, the reason I cringed is because the farthest she jumped was like over behind the camera actually and literally she lunged that way. Oh my goodness, you guys. As the title of this video says, this is what we did on my mom's birthday. So I'm actually going to insert um, the clips from the hotel currently. I'm also then going to incorporate the clips from Buena Vista Street during the day. Um, so you guys are going to see those clips as well. So here we go. see um we had a very nice hotel this is actually the third hotel that we have chosen this one is a chosen one for permanent so we stayed in the best western plus it is actually a cross from the entrance of disneyland or downtown disney if you will it's on the dca side or the buses like where the buses normally park so the hotels that we have been staying on or in, I should say, were always on that side as it was. It's just so much easier to walk into downtown Disney from there. So the very first one that we had stayed in was called Anaheim Hotel. That was at the end of, like, across from, if any of you guys know where Tower Terror now, Galaxy, Guardians of the Galaxy Tower. Um, it's in line with actually that one. Um, so we actually started off by staying in that one. Um... At one point we realized it was actually really, really pricey, and then we wound up staying actually just behind, if you will. Um, it, there is what's called the Anaheim Grove, um, that is actually behind the parking lot of this location. And 
there's a hotel when you walk through the parking lot. There's a hotel right there. Um, and that one was called the Kings something. I think it was just called Kingdoms. I don't know. I don't know the whole name. Kingdoms of Anaheim or something like that. I don't know. But that one was actually like staying in a Motel 6, if you will. Um, we only have stayed in that hotel once. We have stayed in the Anaheim Hotel, I want to say three different times. Um, Best Western, my mom actually got an email, I guess, about a um, discount for there or something like that just before Halloween. That's actually where we were going to try and stay just before Halloween, but it didn't happen. Um, I talked about that in that Halloween video. <laughs> Anyways, so we actually decided after, you know, the fail with Halloween that though for my birthday, we didn't stay in the Best Western. We should have. We stayed in the Anaheim Hotel for my birthday, but did decide for my mom's birthday to actually go to the Best Western. Um, and we had a really, really nice day. They actually gave us bags um, of, like, snacky breakfast items in the morning. You had to go up to the desk and then ask for the to-go bag, and they gave you a little bag, and then we would go back to the room, eat some breakfast, and then we hopped out and would go to Bay of Mystery, where you guys saw that we went. It was really, really, actually really nice. So we stayed the night of the 19th to the morning of the 22nd, in the Best Western, and it was a really, really awesome stay. We actually had in that room, there was actually the um, Freeform channel, so that was kind of nice. So we wound up watching the Christmas movies that were on when we would get back, um, and then hop back over into Disney and watch Disney. So we did the first night that we were there, I kind of had brought some like poppets and stuff like that. I decided I went to do my mom's nails. I had been getting bath bombs, so I brought the bath bombs with us, and because they have these nice tubs, I my mom would take advantage and take a bubble bath, um, which she hadn't done in a really long time, but the very first time we talked about going to a hotel last year in August, I had just decided to bring along with me the bath bombs and let my mom finally enjoy um, her nights, so that's what we would do every night is every night she would take her bubble bath um, and then I would take a shower and just fill the tub and put the little bomb in so I could enjoy it that way. It was kind of like a nice little feet soak for me. Um, I'm always scared to get down in the tubs because I'm more afraid that I'm going to, one, throwing myself out of here, but one, either not fit or two, not be able to get back out. Um, I have sciatica and a pinched nerve. So it becomes really really hard for me and then I have a hernia so it all becomes a really really hard being on the floor is hard enough to move being in a slippery tub with water would probably be even worse so that's just kind of been a fear for me and I don't intend to do it unless I have like one of those like what do you call them the the spa tubs that like you see in some of those old tiny are now more expensive houses yeah those I probably would be able to do it but a regular um, shower tub? No. <laughs> I'm too scared. So I wouldn't do it. Um, but my mom did. She got to enjoy it. So that first night that we were there, um, I treated my mom and, um, she, before her bath, um, we set up, we had these, actually this nice little table, um, and there was like an office chair and like these couch chairs. So we set it up in front of the TV. Um, and I did my mom's nails and then I did my own while she went to go take her shower. Um, so it was a really, really nice like treat for her and a treat for me because I actually got to do what I love to do, which is doing nails. Either on myself or for, on other people. So it was really, really nice to get to do that with her while we watched some Christmas movies. So that was kind of like an amazing treat for us. We had decorated our beds, as you guys saw. As you guys saw, I had brought stuff for her birthday. Yes, it said six. <laughs> yes, it did. Um, <laughs> she's not turning 60. She's turning six. <laughs> I didn't turn 31, I turned 2. <laughs> and last year, I didn't turn 30, I turned 3. <laughs> so that is just how our family works, it is we subtract. Um, but to each his own. But that is what we did. It was so special. Um, and then we wound up getting up every morning. We were out the door. Um, you know, did got our breakfast, came back, snacked a little, did some coffee. Um, and then we got to come home the first 
the day of her birthday. She actually was in her Tinkerbell costume. Um, I wish I had got some pictures or shots of her in her Tinkerbell, but she's camera shy and wouldn't let me do it. Um, <laughs> I really wish I had got clips of it. The clips that you guys actually saw were the day after because she refused to let me um, take shots of it while she was wearing her costume because she knew she would have got in it and she wouldn't let me. She will I had to respect her wishes, and I didn't have her in the video, um, in her Tinkerbell. So the day that you guys saw, she was in her o Olaf um, get-up the next day. So the day after her birthday, basically. <laughs> um, but the shots of the room were the day we got there um, while I while she was in the bath. Um, and I had five seconds, I decided to pull up the camera and film the bedroom while we were working, um, while I was working on my nails. Um, and then went back to finishing, and then that's what you guys saw. So, the morning of her birthday, we got up, we did breakfast, um, we hopped into Buena Vista Street. It actually felt so amazing, because we were there during the day. It was really, really hard to leave, I must say. We just really wanted to be there so bad, just soak up every ounce of being inside of there. It was so cool. Um, we did do a lot of shopping, like we do every time. But we also did a lot of just sitting on a bench, chilling and looking out, um, and just admiring being back in the park. Granted, it's not 100% where, how we would want to have done it, but it was still really, really cool nonetheless. Um, and then we wound up um, driving back home, took care of my parent, my my dad and my grandma. I took over doing all the work for her so she didn't have to. So I ran around doing everything that I could to be of a help, um, making dinner, and then we went back that night. Um, we watched some more Christmas movies. We chilled out. Um, we both were really, really tired. We were supposed to play games, but we were super duper tired, so we didn't do that. Um, we just watched the Christmas movies and then went to bed. Um, and then the next morning we got up and... Went back into Buena Vista Street, did the exact same thing, you know, shopping and then chilling. We weren't supposed to spend anything, but yet we did, because we found 2021 stuff, and I will have a haul from that. Um, we chilled, we had a lot of fun just sitting there watching the people, and then we stopped at Starbucks on the way home. I went to get her a cake pop, um, since she had no ability to let me go stop on her birthday, so we had to do it the day after we stopped it. Starbucks, got cake pop and some breakfast, like breakfast burritos and stuff like that because we were really, really hungry. Um, went home, did the same thing, though she took over this time and not me. And then when everybody went to bed, we went back, um, watched Christmas movies for our final night, packed a lot of our stuff up um, so it makes it easier the next morning, took our showers, enjoyed the Christmas movie, and went to bed. Um... And then the morning that we were leaving, we packed up our room, got our breakfast, ate our breakfast, and then went back to Buena Vista Street. Um, we did light shopping, last minute shopping, um, and then we sat on the bench and really did not want to leave whatsoever. It was really, really hard to leave, honestly, it so was. Because we just wanted to be there and sit there and do nothing but sit and enjoy being in Buena Vista Street. But then we finally did wind up leaving. We had to stop at Walmart on the way home. So that was really why we needed to leave ASAP. Because we had to get a new microwave. But we stopped at a Walmart that was actually um, in Riverside. It's one that I had never been to, but my mom had been to. So we actually wound up getting food, got our new microwave, I actually got some stuff for the poppets. I needed um, drawers and I needed a little caddy. So we wound up getting all that stuff that we needed for the house, like some food. Um, we got dinner and lunch while we were there. We got back to the car, we ate our lunch, and then we finally drove all the way back home. And it was kind of late, granted, but it was fine because we weren't going anywhere. <laughs> so despite how upset my grandma was, um, it was fine. We got back home, we did the normal stuff, we chilled, and um, I was supposed to come in here and actually edit and upload a bunch of stuff, and I wound up passing out till 6.30. And then I went back in my room and had a migraine and passed out <laughs> till 4 in the afternoon the next day. So yeah, and then we had situations with my grandma the 24th and 25th. 
and 26th and 27th, 28th and 29th. And today when I'm filming this, it is the 30th. When you guys are seeing this, I have no idea what it'll be. But anyways, it was still a blast, you guys. We had so much fun. Um, and yeah, we don't get to do it again until January. We are going to celebrate my brother's birthday. Um, he would have been turning 30. So it's a huge milestone and we're going to celebrate for him. And we're going to do a hotel stay, probably only two nights and not three nights. Probably just two nights stay in the hotel, but it'll still be worth it nonetheless. Um, because we're celebrating for him. <laughs> That's actually all I have for you guys in this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.